welcome this is the energy vibration um reading for the scorpion merry christmas scorpions merry christmas it is a month where um it is the month of the moon the moon you guys work with the moon you scorpion so whatever the issue is and the situation is scorpions i want to say merry christmas to everyone thank you for supporting my channel for another wonderful year that we have spent together i want to say to you scorpions because you know i'm calling up on the angels and guides especially for the scorpion to help the scorpion to whatever issues and situation that was going on so um scorpion it has been a rough year for some of you but yet still remember this is a general reading do not take um these reading personally because these are general reading they were not based upon your personal situation okay these are just help middle to help people december has four months and the energy of the moon is here that is the energy for the month if you'd like this the extended of this reading please use the link below and i want to say if you don't have enough money and you'd like to give someone a gift give them a reading three readings is less than ten dollars okay so um it is better that you give someone that they can always remember um that gift okay so cancers let's go in and see what else is happening um the last reading is going to be the full moon for 2019 and then I will speak to you guys in 2020. If you'd like a personalized 2020 reading that gives you bowl to bowl what is going to be happening in every month, you can always order a reading. Okay, let's see what is coming up. So we have the energy of the magician. Um, whatever you decide to do in the first week of December, it's a yes, go ahead and do this. This is an air energy. Um, you're a water sign. Your zodiac, your zodiac energy is also water. So whatever you decide to do in the first week, go ahead and do it because you have the go ahead to do this. Now the energy of the magician is like something unbelievable, something that you wanted really, that you really wanted is going to be happening for you. I'm seeing a commitment coming up for some of you. So if you decide to ask the ends of marriage for someone, go ahead. Or someone is going to ask you to answer the marriage is a yes go for it okay it is a yes it is a yes go for it then we see um, if you're deciding to buy a car or you're deciding to um, buy a car it is a yes also go for it cancer um scorpions your month is looking good it is a yes it is a go ahead um, it is really really positive so um definitely some of you want to ask someone and the ends in marriage is is a yes go ahead now there is at the end of the month a new beginning coming up for you scorpion whatever the issue is the situation is there is definitely a new beginning i'm seeing that you scorpions are having a good month after all the stuff that has been going on a new beginning is going to be happening for you guys at the end of the month so whatever that was there, whatever that was happening, whatever that was transpiring, uh, wonderful. I see you have, and you guys, there's a lot. It's as if your spirit guides are helping you. Whatever is transpiring for you, Scorpion, it's as if your spirit guides are helping you. Say, say thanks to your spirit guides. The Oracle is going to be watching over you guys in the month of December. So the magician is here, and I'm seeing definitely that someone wishes and dreams is going to be coming true. Someone has always wanted to get married. You're going to be getting the ring, and you're going to be liking it. I am seeing it's a yes all over and new beginnings are going to be coming in. So um, whatever you were going through and whatever that was happening and transpiring, yes, it's a yes, go ahead. Some of you are definitely going to be starting new relationships, uh, new contracts are coming in. I'm seeing some of you moving forward. I'm seeing you coming out of an issue. I'm seeing this contract it is a yes. So if you were asking whether or not the person is going to say yes or um, whether you should ask the person, it is a yes. Ask them. Commitment is here. Um, there is new beginnings with people um you know if you were deciding to ask someone to remarry you it's a yes go ahead and ask okay 
So for the Scorpions, what do we have? Angels and guides of the Scorpion comes in and show us what is coming up in December. The energy of the magician and commit. Yes, work on your marriage, work on your relationship. Do not um, um, end your marriage. Whatever is happening, don't end your marriage. Don't end this connection. It was meant to be. Do not end um, whatever connection is there. Don't end it because it, this connection was meant to be, okay? Some of you are going to be working out of a, a, a situation with someone who you have known a very long time and you're going to be healing the energy. The four, stability is coming up for you and your partner, whoever um, your partner is. I'm seeing long-term stability is going to be coming up for both of you. I'm seeing movement. I'm seeing newness. I'm seeing a new offer of love that is going to be coming in. If there was some issues in your relationship, they are saying, don't give up. I told you, I told you. New beginning, <laughs> new beginning in relationships. It's all about relationship. It's all about marriage. It's all about people who wants to heal their marriages, heal their relationship. And um, if you were um, wondering if you should um, get in a relationship with someone new who has come in your life, it is a yes. If someone is returning, it is a yes also. Whoever this person is, it is a yes, okay? The nurturing of energy. I'm seeing some of you having a new contract with this person, whoever this person is. Um, this person is coming in and this person is an Aries. Um, this person is 45 years and older and I'm seeing that you want to reconnect with this person. It is a yes, go for it. Then we have the energy of the director of material, the director of material. I'm seeing you overcoming a situation with a Taurus, Virgo or a Capricorn person. And I am seeing that um, some of you, your parents, I think your parents are getting back together. So, 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 I think you have long ter term stability. Um, so, uh, if you are planning, um, or you know that a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn is going to ask you the ends of marriage, it's a yes. I'm seeing some of you having a new start with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. I am seeing some of you having a new start with a Cancer. I'm seeing you overcoming an issue with a Cancer and you're going to be having new beginnings. I am seeing a yes if you decide to work out an issue with a woman that is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Okay, so we have the quest of energy. Whoever this quest of energy is, whatever is transpiring here and this person, whoever this person is, I'm seeing some of you dealing with this person. Okay, so I'm seeing a lot of fire signs that is coming up. Um, and I'm seeing long-term stability. I'm seeing that changes are coming up. And I'm seeing some of you are going to overcome a situation that... Um, um and 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 uh, uh, a old Aries person have create so an old Aries person and an Aries Leo or Sagittarius young person have created some lies and deception. I'm seeing the energy of an older Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man. Um, I'm seeing a new beginning with this person, so it could be a father figure, and a new beginning is coming in. So I'm seeing family reconnecting. Whatever is transpiring, I'm seeing family reconnecting. I'm seeing that people are going to be there for each other. I'm seeing a new start that is coming up because as you end the month of December, I'm seeing some new start with relationships. So let's say that your relationship was rocky all year. I am seeing a new start coming up with the relationships, okay? Commitment, long-term stability, long-term commitment is coming in for some of you and with a um, someone four or five years and older that is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. Uh, it's a yes to a project if you decide um, to begin or start something with um, 
an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, I'm saying a yes, go for this. I'm saying some of you are trying to work out issues. So, Scorpions, let's see what is transpiring. But anyway, new begins is coming in. I'm seeing some of you. Um, uh, your parents are going to be getting back together, okay? Let's see what is coming out with the energy of the magician. I'm seeing some of you wants to reconnect with it um, and holding on on your finance, but you want a new start and a new um, commitment with a, a Capricorn, okay? So I'm seeing some of you, it can um, once um, to reconnect and work out an issue with a Capricorn. Some of you, you're going to be healing your financial stability because I'm seeing money coming in. The energy of the emperor. Who is this emperor? I'm seeing that there is a situation where um, a new offer could be coming in. I see someone wants uh, um, a new contract with you. I am seeing people wants to connect with you and work with you. So this is very good. I'm seeing some of you overcoming an issue um, with your boss or an issue with people in power. I'm seeing you overcoming that. I'm seeing some of you are dealing with a cancer and you have some regrets. You have overcome a situation with a cancer. You're going to be receiving a new beginning. Some of you, a cancer or someone, your partner could be asking you for a new beginning. So that is good. Uh, definitely another new start is coming up. Some of you um, are going to be, if you are thinking to reconnect with, I'm seeing new start um with a with a virgo i'm seeing a, a virgo what is coming in and wants a new start with you okay so um whoever this um definitely i'm seeing a virgo coming in and wants a new start with you then we have an organization some of you an organization wants to have a new start with you i'm seeing an organization is definitely giving um a taurus virgo or a capricorn some um some break but um you know it's not bad it is really a positive energy for you guys so now whatever that is going on i have to say that the quest of energy whoever this person is what whatever is to inspire there's a young fire sign person and there's an old fire sign person okay Whatever is transpiring, I'm seeing this old and young fire sign person. I'm seeing some of you are going to be receiving a new contract with an organization. And I'm seeing you have a long-term uh, long stability with this organization. I'm seeing definitely someone is going to be coming in and helping you out. But the outcomes here, what I'm seeing with this energy, and I want to know what is this for the scorpion? A lot of you scorpions are dealing with a, a woman 45 years older, uh, older and a young um, person between the ages of 18 and 45. I am a situation with an organization. And these two people, I'm seeing... An end is going to be coming into these two people. Whatever is transpired, I'm seeing you are not going to be moving forward with these two people. Whoever these two people are, they're very deceptive. Okay, so um, let's see. Tell the scorpion the quest. These fire sign people. Tell the scorpion what is happening with these fire sign people. They're definitely Aries, fire sign people. Okay, and you start. Okay, so I'm seeing a new start. I'm seeing these fire sign people want to connect with you and have a re a new start with you. And especially you ladies. And if you are a man and you are in a relationship with someone who is a fire sign and Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, I'm seeing because they're not showing up and, and, and showing what is happening. The only thing that is really being showing up is that some of you... um have overcome a situation with an Aries in an organization, okay? Some of you, it could be a situation with your mom, if your mom is an Aries or a Sagittarius, but I'm seeing a new start with an organization. Whatever is transpiring, I'm seeing definitely a new start in an organization. I'm seeing some of you ladies are going to be receiving... Um, 
uh, you know messages from your child I'm saying Christmas is looking good because everybody everyone is uh, like returning to family I'm seeing um, a cancer who is coming in and wants to offer you something but I don't know if you're going to be taking this I'm seeing this cancer coming in trying to offer you something but are you going to take it I'm, I'm not sure but I'm seeing that a lady um, once a new start with some of you an old lady she's an Aries Leo or Sagittarius and uh, she is um, going to be sending you a message um, you know she wants to connect with you and she wants to have a new start with you so this lady is going to be receiving a message from a child maybe or a child could be sending it to their mom to say they want to have a new start okay so this message is coming up now let's see what else is coming out but i'm seeing you guys protecting yourself from this aries woman and because there's so much secrets it's like the eye princess comes up and said protect yourself so whoever this this it, it can be an aries Leo, or sagittarius person wants to reconnect they're going to be sending you a message i want to reconnect and you're like protect yourself protect yourself because if you don't protect yourself this part <coughs> this person is not being very honest do not give this person another chance okay don't give this person another chance the person isn't honest don't give them another chance okay all right let's see what the magician has oh for the scorpion oh yeah you're definitely coming out of a situation scorpion and whatever you decide to do um yes go ahead and do it i'm seeing jealousy um i'm seeing there could be an, a third party in your marriage okay i'm seeing multiple opportunities that is opening up i'm seeing a new start is coming up for the young people wonderful um message wonderful message wonderful message so i'm seeing some deceptiveness i'm seeing a third party if you are married i'm seeing a third party because it's a relationship it could be an offer from a ooh, a company um a third party there could be an aries that is involved in this third party some of you could find out that a contract that you have don't take it turn your back on the contract that has been offered to you do not take it okay because something is deceptive about this and some of you it has to do with an aries man if you're in a relationship with an aries man um is, is the contract that you're going to receive don't take it okay what else need to come out i'm seeing some of you are going to be offering love um yeah i'm seeing some of you offering love I see that an Aries Leo or Sagittarius is coming in offering love. Don't take it. Bye. Do not take it. Because you're going to find out the truth about this person. A very deceptive person. This person is extremely deceptive. Whoever this person is, just back up. Don't deal with this person. Very deceptive. All right. Um, let me see if anything else. Young people are going to have a new start and um if your mom is a cancer go home at christmas there is a new start the ice queen ideas frozen non-action entitlement scream frozen non-action entitlement so some of you are going to be feeling like this and this is going to affect the older people whatever is transpiring it is going to affect the older people whoever there's an aries woman uh, aries Leo or sagittarius out there is going to want to return in your life no 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 cut them off there's too much secrets it's as if your spirit guides is saying keep them off Alrighty. i want to say thank you so much please like share these videos i love you guys whatever is happening and transpiring 
I really care about you guys. Um, I wish you a lot. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Check out the full moon reading. Namaste. Thank you.